Thank you so much for watching the Press Avenue YouTube channel. My name is John and I love making tutorials and teach people how to better use WordPress. I use it every day for client work and for my own sites and side projects. So if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Additionally, if this was helpful, let me know in the comments. I love the conversations and the new friends that I've met. All right, so let's get to it. This was asked, it's been a while, but in our Facebook group, facebook.com slash group slash Press Avenue, where people have follow-up conversations with me and others about WordPress questions and the different videos and tutorials that I've made. And the question that's come up is, how do I beta test WordPress? How do I you know, get the latest version? Is there an easy way? Do I have to download and upload, etc.? And there is an easy way and it's through a plugin. So I've logged in just to a testing staging area and I've gone to plugins and then add new and I'll simply type beta. And then the WordPress beta tester plugin, it's been out for quite a while. Um, only has four stars, I don't know why in reviews, but it works absolutely great. After it's installed, if you go to tools, you'll see beta testing on the left hand side and it gives you some options. So do you want a nightly, a beta or re release candidate, which is the RC, or bleeding edge nightlies? And the bleeding edge is, um, you know, they push through an update, they haven't really talked about it. It's, you know, by the hour, whatever you want. So I'm gonna go to beta and hit save. And then it says saved. Why don't you head over and upgrade now? So let's see, updates. Nope, beta testing. Maybe we'll go to bleeding edge here and see if we can find one. Currently the site is set to update, there we go. So if I go to point nightlies, I kind of missed this, sorry. Um, it says your site is currently up to date with 5.3.3 alpha, which says it down here. If I go to bleeding edge, it takes me to the next bigger version, which is 5.4, which has quite a few updates and changes. RC, which means release candidate. 4, it's release candidate 4, and then some numbers. So I'll hit save. Now I'll go to dashboard and updates. And then I can update it straight from the typical WordPress update button. So now here we are in WordPress 5.4. This is the welcome screen. Every welcome screen from here on out has been different. Usually they feature a jazz musician. Sometimes they have fun colors. When Gutenberg first came out, it was kind of a pink and tan. Now we've gone to blue and gray. Um, so this has a lot of stuff with new blocks. And this is the welcome screen here. Um, this particular one has gradients with buttons and new social icons and button thing with Gutenberg. So you can put one button next to another. Um, page builders have struggled adding this. Um, and a lot of different add-ons for page builders have made this available and now WordPress does it just right out of the gate so you don't even need those. Uh, cleaner navigation, etc. So this is just 5.4 before it releases. Now this could be 5.5, 5.6, etc. So um, this one's set to release in six days. Um, but if I got back on, you know, 15 days ago and I could try out you know, 5.4 re release candidate two or a one, etc. So now I have this 5.4 updated. So if I go back and scroll down, you'll see down here, instead of saying the version, it says the development version and gives me it here. And I can see all the changes. For example, if I go to add new in this particular one, um, I think it might be on pages, let me check. Yeah, it gives kind of a more full screen area. They've, they've cleaned these up up here, um, but that's a whole nother tutorial. So that's how you beta test WordPress. Um, it's simply through the plugins and add the WordPress beta tester. If this was helpful in any way, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments. Lastly, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button to see more WordPress tutorials like this. Thank you so much for watching.